So a Mac trick that's perhaps not very well known is that you can use your iPhone to take a picture or scan a document and save the results directly on uh, the desktop. You don't have to email it to yourself, you don't have to use some weird copy paste, and you don't even have to use AirDrop. So, so one of the coolest things that you can do with your Mac and your iPhone is that if you want a picture on your Mac and you want to take it with a good phone on your camera, then uh, your iPhone camera, then instead of just taking it and airdropping it to yourself, you can just do it directly in a much more convenient way. So here's what you do. You right click on your desktop anywhere. You get this option right at the bottom to import from your iPhone or iPad. as showing all the devices which are currently on the same Wi-Fi and with Bluetooth on. So I have this phone here called the iPhone 51. I select that phone and uh, what it does is it puts my phone into camera mode. And I pick up the phone, I take my picture like so. It gives me the option to use the photo or to retake it. I will just use it like this and instantly the picture ends up on my desktop right there. And that's not all. Suppose you want to take a, a sketch, you want to make a sketch, but you don't want to use the Mac for it, you want to use the phone because you can use it with the finger. You do the same thing, right click, go to import from iPhone or iPad, but this time you take the select the sketch option and this will put the phone into sketch mode. You pick up the phone, you do your sketching, you know, whatever you want to do, the doodling, any way you like, and as soon as you click done, instantly it appears on your desktop without doing anything else. And you can just open it and start using it very fast, very convenient. And finally, and perhaps the one that I find the most useful, you can also use uh, the scanner in a similar fashion. Go to the same menu, but this time use the scan option. And again, it'll wake up your phone and it'll put it into scanner mode this time. And uh, we're just gonna scan a document. I have a book here. I'm gonna scan the cover of the book and uh, just put it over here. And if you've used the scanner before, you know how handy it is. You just position your phone until the scan happens and it lets you just uh, save it from there. But this time, as you can see, it saves it directly onto the desktop. So there's no extra step and uh, you have the scan on the desktop, it's scanned perfectly, all the margins are correct and everything. So this is extremely handy, especially if you have a lot of documents to scan. So here are three ways in which uh, you can use uh, your iPhone together with your Mac, and I hope you found those useful. Thanks for watching.